During production of the journey in 2018, seven recruits were separated from the 73rd Basic Academy class, including Ashley Cash yes, and Bottom Hicks. Both recruits made impressive comebacks to the Chesterfield County Police Department. My name is Ashley Cash. I'm from Vesuvius, Virginia. I went to Longwood University, which is where I met uh, Officer Malatesta, and she recruited me from Longwood, and I moved straight here. When I graduated from Longwood, I moved here the summer of 2018 to start the Chesterfield Police Academy. Yes, sir. Early on in the academy, it got to where I could no longer do a push-up. And it's not because I was weak, because I'm not a weak person. So in college, the injury, the wrist injury came about because I played rugby all throughout college. And my coach tackled me one day at practice and messed up my wrist, which I didn't know until the academy. But it physically hurt to do a push-up. So I told my training staff and my classmates when it got checked out, and it turns out I had torn everything in my left wrist. And then, followed by that, I tried to jump back into it after rehab of my left wrist, and it turned out I tore some things in my right wrist. The injury was going to prevent me from doing something that I've always wanted to do. Officer Cash was out of action for almost two years, but was medically cleared for the 79th Basic Academy. When I heard that I was good to go for the 79th Basic Academy, that was the best feeling I've ever had. Because for the longest of time, I, it was just getting knocked down. I didn't think I was ever going to make it, and it was a sigh of relief. The first week of the Academy is supposed to scare everyone to a degree. But I was essentially glad to be back in that role, just because it's what I want to do, and I know I had to get through it to get to where I want to be. FDO has been great. I like seeing how to do the job, learning how to do the job more in depth. My FDO has been great. I'm learning a lot and it's been a really nice experience. My favorite thing so far about being a police officer is just trying to get things off the street that shouldn't be on the street and trying to talk to people and trying to better their situation. Quantum Hicks restarted his journey with the 81st Basic Academy in March of 2021. The county, the department believed in me when I didn't believe in myself. That was the biggest thing to me. Um, just as I'm showing their support, you know, they're telling me keep pushing, you know, keep reaching to this goal of being an officer. So that was uh, the support from the uh, department brought me back. During his time away from the academy, recruit Hicks worked as a police service aide in Chesterfield County. It was wonderful, um, especially if you want to do this uh, job as being an officer, you know, it teaches you things that you will learn on the road, just, you know, not just going to hot calls or anything, the report writing, especially interacting with the citizens, you're going to be dealing with them on a daily basis. So once you master that, you know, just being comfortable, being around people, talking to people, I think mean, it'll help you out a whole lot. Even though you were in that situation at that time, it was hard, you know, things were going mentally through your brain or anybody personally. Just take a second, take your breath, get your thoughts together. You know, from my position in the department, my goal was always wanting to be an officer. If you get an injury in the academy, at least in this department, don't rush it. Don't come back before your doctor says not to or if your doctor even says you could start now, but I recommend waiting longer. Take the longer time. The academy is very physically demanding, and it has to be. It should be. Don't rush it. It pays off in the end. No matter all the obstacles, I just took a different route to get there. Um, I worked in different positions in the department to help me get back to that route. So just never give up, no matter what situation you face. Um, all the bad thoughts going through your head, just never give up. Just stay strong. Um, and just keep grinding, keep pushing. And everything happens for a reason, so I try to look at it like that.